Artworks offers a new approach and a new style of presentation that's different from anything else they may already have on their shelf. In keeping with art education trends, Artworks breaks from the traditional chronological presentation of specific art styles. Instead, it focuses on issues, ideas, and themes. Students are encouraged to uncover trends and patterns in art, to understand connections, causes, and effects in art, and to learn to recognize the factors that maintain or change the world. In terms of presentation, it became clear very early on that this project would not lend itself well to a traditional textbook format. Our programs are not lecture or reading based programs. A traditional 30 page narrative chapter doesn't have a great deal of utility in the arts. Instead, we organize the book into 26 discrete topics that don't necessarily need to be used in a sequential way. There's lots of use of something called juxtaposition, which is putting ideas, images side by side so that uh, students can look at, um, at artwork from different time periods and see what their relationship is to each other. It's important to note that each topic has a three-stage presentation. The first few pages serve as a general introduction to the topic concept. They are followed by a feature entitled Reflecting, Reading and Analyzing that prompts students to analyze professional or student work in light of what they've just read. The topic then ends with something called creating and presenting that walks students through a project that applies the topic concept. Uh, there's a couple of chapters, topics in the textbook that are particularly engaging both for teachers and students. There's a, a topic about the future and careers in art, and this is something new in an art textbook for students. There's another chapter that deals with legal issues, again, something very interesting to find in an art textbook. 